Well, earlier this morning we began with a very pleasant kind of feel outside. That's because the humidity has been definitely on the lower side. Temperatures are already beginning to warm up, though. Now at noon coming in around 76 degrees. We've seen a nice amount of sunshine, but there's been a lot of cloud cover as well. We'll call these scattered clouds. A couple of those a little bit more cumulus clouds trying to kind of build in the atmosphere. If that happens, there's a pretty good potential. We could have maybe some pop up showers popping up a little bit later on this afternoon and this evening as the temperatures continue to climb, but really kind of keeping our eye on the deep south Mississippi, Louisiana getting hit pretty hard. They've already had a few tornado warnings down there. Nothing like that up here. That stalled boundary is going to hold that moisture a little bit further to the south. Meanwhile, here in Kentucky, things are looking a OK. Again, feeling a little bit less muggy out there than it has for the past couple of days. There's just a little spot there west of the Danville area, maybe a couple of showers down around Nashville, but the rest of us are seeing dry conditions now at noon. We'll take that. We had some soakers moving through yesterday, and there's still the possibility we could have a couple of pop up thunderstorms maybe a little bit later on. But what you're going to notice is less humidity today. Usually when we have the higher levels of humidity, you start to get into more of those darker shades of green, but where you've got these kind of breaks in the green, that's where a little bit more of that dry air is taking shape. So we'll definitely take that, especially for mid June, but all good things must come to an end. As we start to get closer to the weekend, not only does humidity start to make a comeback, but also those rain chances begin to kind of ramp up. This is Saturday and Sunday, 50 and 60% chance of precipitation or rain coming up. Possibility of some storms as well. Let's walk through future track right now. Dealing with a nice mixture of clouds and sunshine through the rest of the day. Again, 2 p.m., 3 p.m., there's a pretty good shot at seeing maybe a couple of quick soakers moving through the area. So pop up showers into a little bit later on this afternoon we will dry out again overnight. Then there's a little disturbance uh, could be maybe a quick moving storm that comes through really late tonight or really early tomorrow morning, whichever way you want to look at it. Then after that, We'll dry back out and we'll see a pretty much dry day coming up for Thursday. The humidity stays low again tomorrow, but I think today is probably your best bet to maybe do some dog walking or jogging or running outside in the lower humidity. I think it's going to feel better today than tomorrow. Heading into Friday, though, most of us will be on the drier side, but then again, those showers of rain and some storms will be returning into the weekend. High of 80 degrees, keeping it with the nice mixture of clouds and sunshine. Again, afternoon showers are possible. West winds around 5 to 10 miles per hour through the 7 8 day forecast, rather the extended forecast. We will introduce a few more of those rain showers as we push closer to Friday. Saturday and Sunday look to be a little bit more rainy and kind of active as well. We'll go from 85 degrees on Saturday, which means yeah, it's going to be a little bit hotter, but then we'll kind of rest in the lower 80s by Sunday.